lots of times you don't really need to make a whole new dish. You just need to make something that's small and tastes potent. We're gonna take pretty much everything in my kitchen and turn them into brighteners. We're gonna start by pounding up a lot of garlic. You add salt to it because salt helps break down garlic. The reason to pound it up is because it's easier to disperse through a sauce. So that's the beginning. The first one is parsley oil. Pounded up garlic, chopped parsley. Probably that's how much I really use. And olive oil. Kind of amazing how good that tastes. So let's say you used all of that up over two days and you had this much left, but we're having you know dinner with your whole family. You could take as your beginning the end of that parsley oil, add chopped up olives, capers, and I'm using this amount because it's the amount that I have, some lemon zest, and olive oil, and a little bit of lemon juice, because why the heck not? Another totally amazing sauce. The next one is really cool because it uses something that we never think of as a sauce. These are walnuts that so many of us have around all the time. They could also be almonds. Parsley, if you have leftover parsley oil, you could certainly use that. And some red wine vinegar and olive oil. This makes a really amazing sauce. Again, starting with our pounded up garlic, a bunch of scallions, pickled chilies, lime juice, a lot of cilantro, almost like I used the parsley before, and some salt. And there's another one. This one I'm gonna start without garlic, just because I think it's really important to understand with all of these that the point isn't that you ever need anything. You need something that's strongly flavored. So we're gonna use red onion, salt, lime, a little bit of a, of a cucumber, cilantro, pickled chilies. I have more parsley left over, so I'm adding it. With all of these, the goal is to make something that elevates and illuminates a simple food. 